In the realm of spiritual disciplines, ancient Pali mantras hold a significant place, offering deep insights from times long past. These mantras, a blend of sacred syllables, are not mere chants, but keys to unlocking the sublime energies that pulse through the universe and our very being. At the heart of this mystic practice lies the belief in energy centers, known as chakras. There are said to be 114 of these centers, with 112 within the human body and two residing outside it. Each chakra is a whirlpool of energy that resonates with the vibrations of the cosmos. The unique combination of syllables in Pali mantras is designed to activate these centers, creating a frequency that is as unique as a fingerprint. These chakras are more than just focal points of energy within the body. They're gateways to a deeper understanding of the self and the cosmos. Each chakra vibrates at a specific frequency and is associated with different aspects of our being, from the most material level of existence to the highest state of consciousness. Activating various combinations of these chakras can yield a myriad of effects particularly the manifestation of cities, which are extraordinary abilities or powers. These cities are not seen as magical phenomena, but rather as natural extensions of the human potential that lie dormant within each person, awaiting awakening. For instance, stimulating the lower chakras, which are connected to our primal instincts and physicality, in conjunction with certain higher chakras, which relate to intuition and spirituality, may result in the city of body transcendence, where one may experience a sense of being beyond the physical constraints of time and space. Conversely, concentrating on the heart chakra, known for its association with love and compassion, while simultaneously activating the throat chakra, the seat of communication could potentially unlock a city of profound influence, allowing one's words to carry deep resonance and the power to heal or inspire. The third eye chakra, positioned at the forehead between the eyebrows, is traditionally associated with insight and vision that transcends the physical. When activated in harmony with the crown chakra, which is said to connect us to the divine, one might access cities such as clairvoyance or heightened states of enlightenment. It is believed that these cities are not the goal of the spiritual path, but are milestones that signify progress on the journey toward self-realization. They serve as reminders of the latent potential within us and the interconnectedness of all existence. However, the wisdom traditions that teach about chakras and siddhis also caution that these powers should be approached with humility and respect as they carry great responsibility. The attainment of siddhis through the activation of chakras is a profound process that involves disciplined practice, often under the guidance of a knowledgeable teacher. It is a path that requires purity of intention, ethical conduct, and an understanding that the true purpose of gaining such powers is to aid in one's spiritual evolution and to serve the greater good. These mantras serve a kaleidoscope of purposes. Some are woven to form a shield of energy, a protective cocoon that guards against negative forces. Others are incantations that dispel darkness, much like a ray of light piercing through shadows. Then there are those that act as vessels, accumulating spiritual energies that nourish the soul. For healing, certain mantras act as a balm, harmonizing the energy flow within, nurturing the body and spirit back to health. There are also those that serve as keys, unlocking chakras to a flood of spiritual wisdom, allowing a seeker to tap into the wellspring of universal knowledge. The power of intent is not lost in these sacred chants. Some mantras are crafted for the projection of intent, to influence the world around us and to create an aura of attraction. The spectrum of energies that emanate from our being can, indeed, touch lives, influence events, and shape realities. The ancient sages understood the intricate web of existence and knew that the celestial dance of planets and stars influenced these energy centers. Alignments of celestial bodies can enhance or diminish the effects of mantras. 
an alchemical transformation of energies akin to the celestial movements themselves. This is why there exists a multitude of mantras, each a variation of sound and intent, resonating differently with the alignment of stars and planets. It is a personalized experience, as each individual resonates differently to these mantras. Birth elements and dominant energies play a crucial role in how effective a mantra can be for an individual. Exploration and awareness are the keys to understanding the impact of a mantra. As one delves into this practice, it becomes apparent how the activation of different chakras or combinations thereof casts a unique energy spectrum around us. This magnetic field, pulsating with the energy of our intent, has the potential to influence our surroundings and even reforge reality itself. The journey with Pali Mantras is one of discovery, of unlocking the potential within and harmonizing with the energies of the universe. It is an invitation to partake in the ancient alchemy of the soul, a path walked by mystics and sages leading to the extraordinary realms of Siddhis and beyond. In this sacred soundscape, one finds protection, healing, and the profound ability to shape the world, guided by wisdom whispered through the ages. As we bring this journey through the timeless echoes of Pali Mantras to a close, I'm reminded of the threads that connect us all in the vast tapestry of existence. If these whispers from the ancient world resonate with you, if they stir something within the depths of your heart, I encourage you to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Your insights enrich our collective exploration. And if you feel called to join our community on this shared quest for wisdom and inner peace, please consider subscribing. By doing so, you become a part of a living tradition. Each of us a seeker of enlightenment in our own right. Your presence in this community is the very embodiment of the unity we cherish. Thank you for engaging, for your support, and for being willing to journey with us one mantra at a time.